So the next question is, can you provide any wisdom about transgender movement and confusion is causing among the collective? And I explained this in, in my, one of my last shows. Maybe somebody can link it here. And I explained it very clearly. And it was just about that you're seeing the as below versions all the time. This is why when we're on the physical plane and we're judging things uh, based on the physical plane, and I also got about 15 more minutes on this, and then we got a hard stop. I'm going to see if we can actually do some giveaways. There's about 17 more questions, so I may have to, well, we're almost there. So let me just try to do rapid fire on this and get this out of the way. So the as below version of all this self unity is manifesting itself on the physical plane, which is often distorted as the awareness of LGBTQAE plus and all the stuff that they're adding to it, meaning that. Although it looks misconstrued, what is really being said on a metaphysical level is wake up, humanity. You're positive, negative, and neutral. You're not just a male. You're not just a female. You're actually an androgen at minimum because you have this ability to create. And the more that you're aware of that internally, then the more that you'll begin to access and access the power that corresponds to that. Now, of course, when it comes out externally, it is often distorted where you have people that are somewhat confused about the generative components and the process of generation and just staying in that confusion rather than solidifying where they're at, which it should be in the center and beginning to actually go within. Because if you notice, the main theme around all of these sexual persuasions is a large amount of external what others feel about me what others think about me. I want others to like me, even if I need to change myself into another gender so that I can feel liked. Everything there is external. So that's more of a psychological uh, issue than it is, a, or in a psycho-spiritual issue than anything else. And it stems from us just putting everything back into alignment about who we truly are so that we're not confused. And then, of course, even things like singularity are metaphysical things acting out on the spiritual or on the physical plane that are often confused. Singularity, of course, in this case, being that everything comes from the same thing. Even the chips, the plastic, the dirt, the flesh, the blood, all that is coming from the same organism. So I trust that they get some insight. Maybe someone can link where I went into that in a bit more depth.